By the time students gathered at schools like Castle Troy College this morning, the results had already been seen by most. I went online before I came in to make sure they were all right and then I came in so I could face everyone when I came in. Not so James Murphy. He wanted that element of surprise. Engineer at age two. Are you happy with your results? I am. I'm buzzing. That's, that's unbelievable. I'm buzzing. I'm buzzing. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Once again this year, students' marks have been artificially boosted post-marking. The boost this year is an average of 7.5%. This means that 68% of all grades are higher than they naturally would have been. Next year, a process will begin to bring marks back gradually to pre-COVID levels. I did say from 2025 we would see the adjustment uh, being reduced over time, step by step. The State Examinations Commission will determine how long that will take, but I'm very clear it shouldn't be a cliff edge. It should be a very small um, reduction, if you like, over a number of years. I did amazing. Um, so, 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 so in English I got an O3, in maths I got an O2, in geography I got a H4. Words couldn't express how proud I am and she's the best and all her hard work paid off and we're just so, so thankful it's all over now. Coming back into school on this special day was emotional for some. School days over. Oh, I'm very happy with the teachers. They're my best friends, like, you know. He's my best pal. Do you know what I mean? He, they all helped me, so yeah, I appreciate I am appreciative of them. Will you miss this bunch? I miss her in particular. She's a character since first year. Absolutely Woo. brilliant. So we really bond a great friendship now first year and kept it the whole way through. Emma O'Kelly, RTE News, Castletroy College in Limerick.